I appeal to the world. Uh, I'm a Mishal Malik, wife of uh, incarcerated uh, liberation leader Muhammad Yasin Malik, and. I appeal to the world. Uh, I'm a Mishal Malik, wife of uh, incarcerated uh, liberation leader Muhammad Yasin Malik, and right now he is in the hard death cell. And reports are that he's critically he's ill, and the way he's been kept in a five and to seven feet uh, death cell with an open latrine, and he's not being given any medical care. He's critically ill. There's pus in his uh, in his ear. There is. He has a metallic valve, uh, his uh, back discs are damaged, he's being tortured, he's not being given proper medical care and he's, he is literally uh, walking into uh, slow death right now and I have no whereabouts about him and there are strong rumors about him not being there. I appeal to the world to raise a voice for my husband. He's also a political prisoner and he is the face of the freedom struggle. And if God forbid anything happens to him, it's the Indian state that's responsible. Every prisoner has a right to medical aid. And even the doctors at Tehar have said that he must immediately be shifted to ICU. But there is absolutely no response. There is a deathly silence from the Indian side. I don't know what they want to do with him. And then these strong rumors and I have no contact with him. And I'm not allowed to talk to him for the past five uh, five months and I'm really deeply disturbed and as his family deeply concerned about his whereabouts and his health condition. <laughs>